Hello St. Andrews, welcome to my world. So this is the attic of St. Andrews Parish in Hopkinton, New Hampshire, Episcopal Church. And I think it, the, the construction is about 175 or 200 years old. We're looking at the external stone building and then actually another building built inside of the, of the stone structure. Um, we have a whole separate uh, construction very unique where there's actually a gap in between the outer stone and the inner construction for what we can see down inside the nave. To get up into the bell tower involves a series of ladders and steps uh, above the, um, the upper organ you can see the curved ceiling up there and that's what we'd be climbing over uh, to get up to the access to the ladder which accesses the hatch which is where the uh, bell towers, the bell tower is and access to the bells themselves. Across the way, you can see the, the cables that uh, pull the bells. And here's the main bell cord that was just recently replaced. Part of the process is going to be removing this blown in insulation and restoring that, freshening that up. We need to remove it in order for the contractor to get access to the uh, plaster and lath, the lath specifically underneath it. Make sure it's all in good condition. The knob and tube wiring is being replaced. It served its purpose well over the years. The manual labor that was involved in the construction of this, it's just amazing. Even to carry these beams up here in order to, to place them, um, it's just, amazing the the process you know you talk about the the pyramids and and building something like that well this isn't on that scale of course but it's it still involved a lot of labor a lot of thought in order to get these beams up there these beams are about 40 foot long almighty god maker of what is seen and what is unseen we praise you for the beauty we see every day of our steeple and our windows and our carvings. And we praise you for the beauty that is hidden between the walls and over our heads in the wiring and the insulation and the lath and in the timbers. We remember before you today Bezalel and Oholiab, those first named craftspersons of the Hebrew Bible. And we give you thanks for the craftspersons past and present who have tended our space. God, in our worship of you here, tend us also, outwardly as the world sees, and inwardly in our hidden spirits. Amen. Oh, I'm attaching this light so people can see going up the stairs. Yeah, censored. <laughs>